Hey, what's up YouTube? Andrew Rooney here. We're back with another Patreon pick. This one is for Nathan McIntyre, legendary drummer called Gavin Harrison, and the song is called Anesthetize. I've never heard this song. I've certainly heard of Gavin Harrison, and I've checked him out a little bit. He's just a staggeringly amazing drummer. I'm going to have to do another disclaimer. On the previous video, I mentioned that we had one of our uh, lovely neighbors off in the distance there who was blasting their hip hop. And I hope it didn't come through on the mic. And this time, any of you guys content creators out there like podcasters or anything like that, as soon as you hit record, either someone starts a weed eater or, or starts a lawnmower like right next door. Or, or parks a car really closely with a car stereo that's just blaring every time. Today, it's a dog. So we get we get two types of dogs that interrupt podcasts and YouTube uh, recordings. It's the dog where if you walk past the house, it goes... And the dogs were across the road. And as soon as they saw me, they came bounding over. <laughs> goes nuts at you right as you walk past the house this is a different dog this is a dog over here as soon as i hit record on anything slow bark and it's just rawr. 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 Honestly, honestly, for all the patrons, thank you so much. I am doing my best to get to your videos. Some of the requests are quite long songs, <laughs> so we'll see how we do. And um, yeah, just again, thank you so much. Let's get into it. This is uh, wild already. Just uh, stopping real quick. There's levels to the game, right? There is levels to the game. Gavin is right up there. Oh, unbelievable. The accuracy, the precision, and the control. Oh, my God. Oh my god! Wow! What a machine. Those little bells. They're so tiny. Easy to miss.
Oh, wow. I bet he's a Dave Wickle guy. There's a lot of Wickleisms in here, uh, aside from the no traditional grip, but yeah, crazy. Oh my gosh. I have to say, it is really refreshing to watch um, these drum reaction videos when it's at a clinic. Um, if, if you don't know what a clinic is, a clinic is, you know, when a touring drummer or, a, or just a drummer on a clinic tour goes out and just plays drums for you. Um, it's very drum geek stuff but it's great for this footage because obviously um when there's a band you know people tend to focus on the singer or you know looking all around just drums fantastic let's go back a bit even more that lick there sounds very wickle Oh, see it. Turn my kick up. Can't hear my kick in my in ears. What a beast! The accuracy. Pretty miraculous stuff. This is next level. Oh my god. And then he's got that in the back pocket waiting to come out. Wait up. Wait. The other way around the toms. That blam fill. Love it. Monster! Thank you. Oh, thank you. I gotta say, I'm sitting here a little bit stunned, Nathan McIntyre. I mean, I know Gavin Harrison, he's one of the absolute legends. He's, you know, he's cover of modern drummer magazine kind of level drummer 
So I guess it's not to be unexpected, but man, it's just mind blowing. I just think of the precision, the commitment. I mean, I just think of, yeah, the commitment. That's the word for someone like this. Forget talent and um, natural gifts. This is just 100% commitment. And I've heard Gavin speaking on a podcast episode. When he was coming up, he had some kind of arrangement with his practice room or the guy that he rented his practice room off where he would, he, I think it was something like he didn't have a key and the guy would leave and he would get a six hour window where he could uh, do his practice. Um, so he learned so much about himself and the drums because he couldn't leave. He literally couldn't do anything else. So there's just a room with a drum kit in it. So he just play the drums and yeah that's what i see with these with these super drummers i mean gavin harrison is in the super drummer level you know along with your dennis chambers and dave wickles and tony royster juniors and it's just i just see the commitment it's just it's just phenomenal it's it's really mind-blowing i'm i'm a little bit shaken after watching that i need to check out more gavin harrison I actually got out one of his books. <laughs> I got a, it was a book of transcriptions that I found at the library of all places uh, of Gavin Harrison. And it was like, it was seriously like that thick. It was ridiculous. And it was very, very complex. A lot of odd time, three, eight, seven, eight, nine, eight, and just constantly changing um, meter. And yeah, what a legend. What a, what an amazing player and really unique voice on the instrument too. Anyway, if you dug this um, reaction, be sure to subscribe, hit the like button and hit me in the comments with whatever you want me to react to. I will do my best to get to it. Until next time, take it easy. Ciao.